break in this catcher's mitt with me. Today we've got a Wilson A2K M1D. We're going to be doing a box break in so the fingers will have a hinge and so will the thumb. Therefore, the center of your palm is going to stay flat. To make this quicker, I'm going to use the hot water treatment and no, this doesn't automatically ruin a glove. Now we just have to do a tremendous amount of mallet work. This is where it gets tiring. You need to be creating the hinges from the back of the glove. So just a reminder, that's where you should hit. Plus you need to go crazy on the palm and especially your pocket just to loosen up all that leather. By the way, you guys, there's a bonus tip. Plus, once you can squeeze your glove, just go play catch. For a true box break-in, you need to curl the fingertips in like so and do the same exact thing on the thumb side. The most important thing is just to squeeze the ball. So 